My name is Aaron Cairo. I'm a sponsored skateboarder from the San Francisco Bay Area. And today, I'm gonna teach you how to kickflip. So I've made a bunch of kickflip tutorials. This will actually be how to kickflip the easiest way tutorial 3.0. There's so many people asking questions about kickflips. We get a ton of skate supports about kickflips specifically. And today I'm super excited because we have a professional slow motion camera filmer here today. So we're gonna get a bunch of incredibly slow shots of the kickflip and break it down. So no matter where you are in skateboarding, you can improve on your kickflip. So check this out. Here is the foot position for the kickflip. Your back foot is on the tail like this. I prefer to have the ball of the foot right there in the middle section of the tail. This is very important because actually how this works is your ankle pushes down. You don't push down with your whole leg. It's super important to understand that. If your whole leg pushes down, it's far too slow. So the snap of your foot, your ankle, your foot going down, just that muscle of your ankle, boom, can pop that board down really fast. Now this right here, this is the key 100% most important part of the kickflip. You drag your toe up the board and then your ankle again pops up. So I hate to say it, but it's really the ankles on the back foot and the ankles on the front foot. So your front foot is in that foot position with your foot right there. I go about a 45 degree angle just down from those bolts like that. And I envision this line going from right here up to right there on the board. So the toe drags just like that and then pops up. It's that pop up right there. I didn't really spot this myself until I saw the kickflip at 1000 frames a second, which is very slow, slow motion, but it drags. And then once that foot pops up, it's weird. It's like this magical unicorn flies out, hits your board and it just perfectly spins. Then your back foot, which is up above the board because your knee is bent, will just come down Stop that board right there, drop it, and you will land. And it will be the best day of your life. True statement, for real. Okay, so a couple things that will help you with this is to practice, 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 practice. So you might be thinking to yourself, how do we practice, Aaron? Okay, you stand on your back foot and hold the board like that. You drag your foot up repeatedly in this motion, just like that. This motion and then the pop up motion is very, very, very important. If you get those really down, just standing still on this practice step, the rest will come a lot easier for you. When I taught Lance how to kickflip, every time he started having troubles, he would stop, he would go back to this, he would drag his foot up, and um, you know, then he would get it back on his board, boom, kickflip. Okay, so you drag and then pop that foot up. So you go back to that practice step. Now here, this is the next most important thing I want you to learn. So you're gonna do a kickflip and you're gonna make the board spin. And then you're going to land on top of the board with only your front foot. I specifically want you to have your front foot land on the board because if you practice by kicking off and having your front foot go to the ground, you're going to get in a very bad habit which is flicking down. And remember, we're always, 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 always flicking up. Up. There's a bunch of different styles of kickflips, a bunch of different kickflips that people do, and we're gonna show you a bunch of different kickflips so you can just kind of see the differences. But these basic mechanics of the toe dragging up and your foot popping up are common between all of them. And you'll be able to see and you can kind of pick out the different styles and the various things as we roll through this here. Okay, so first off is my kickflip. You see the drag, the flick up. I think it is so fascinating how that flick up of the toe I love to watch these in slow motion. So I had everybody here do a kickflip and we can just check it out. Uzi Walker up next, see that drag? Now watch his ankle pop. The board spins, turns around, his back foot catches and he lands. The slow motion is so helpful. All right, Daniel, let's see what we got. Pop, flick. His flick was a lot less pronounced, a lot, a lot less. He almost flicked down, but not really but the board did spin beautifully and make it nice and around. Nigel, pop, flick. You see, his flick was way earlier. He didn't drag his foot and then flick. He kind of flicks right away. So interesting. All right, Darren, who filmed all the awesome slow motion for this video, let's watch this front foot drag, flick, woo! Watch that board spin, beautiful back foot catch, lands it and roll up. Let's see who's next. I think it's Troy Young. Okay, pops that back foot, drag, flick, 
spin, back foot catch, boom. It's like you train your feet to do this. If you if you just do that practice step and train your feet, your back foot will catch it. Fetty here has the most beautiful kick flip of everyone. He's got my vote. Look at that ninja flick right there. That is something that you learn over time. You're just able to extend that knee out. Here's Carl Watson. This is actually a switch flip. Huge thanks to Carl for coming out. So rad. Drag that foot. Look at that flick. Again, look at that ninja style. Oh, I just love that. When the board is going down, like you flick it and the nose of the board goes down, I think it looks so, so rad. Now here's Carl on the regular kickflip coming in. Watch his back foot, the ankle. You see that power in the ankle pop down and then boom, very fast. Front foot, drag up, flick. Back foot catch, beautiful execution. All right, now this is one of my favorite kickflips out of all of these. This is Carl Watson's son. Super incredible. I wanted to show this so much because this is probably the majority of the people learning to kickflip are going to be like this. Drag the foot, flick that. Boom, look at how extended his front knee was. And then his back foot comes up. And he just 100% full commitment lands it like a boss and then puts his feet on like what? So incredible. Kickflip number two. Let's see, back foot in the foot position. You see everybody has a very similar foot position, almost exactly the same. Now that back foot, that ankle is going to pop down. Front foot, drag up, and then flick real fast. And you see his, his toe flicks up, spins, back foot catch, lands, boom. So, 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 so good. If you guys land on the board, you take it. You don't go, ah, oh, let me do it again. No, you kick flipped, have a win. You can leave it in the comments below which person in the video you felt like had the best kick flip. But really the point of this video is for you, yes you, to learn this trick. If you get the kickflip down really, really, really well, all of skateboarding is like a lot more fun. It, it just really is. Because the amount of tricks you can get after you land the kickflip are enormous. You can do tray flips, backside flips, frontside flips, all kinds of stuff. So just make sure you get these basics. Um, another thing that I want to point out is if you're new to skateboarding, and this happens to almost every single skater, if you're brand new to skating, learn those earlier tricks first. It is ollie, frontside 180, backside 180, pop shove, front shove, heel flip if you want to. You could skip that one if you want to, but then go into the kick flip. If you do those earlier tricks, it will help you out so much because you have a solid foundation to put the kick flip on top of. I hope that makes sense and I hope you guys, yes, you guys are learning how to kick flip. Go to BrailleSkateboarding.com, log in, be a part of the whole skateboard community across the whole world and get your rank. If you guys have not checked that out, it's really incredible and it's for you to learn how to skateboard. It has the first beginning tricks in order and you can get your rank and then there are also tutorial videos that you can check out. We've made so many. The other thing that you should know that is there for you is Skateboarding Made Simple is a full lesson plan. It is an hour long video that takes you through all of the basic skateboarding tricks and if you get stuck on any of them you can go to BrailleSkateboarding.com and submit a skate support. So if you're having troubles with your kickflip tell me in the video all the tricks that you know, show yourself attempting all of those tricks and then show a bunch of attempts of your kickflip and I'm going to get your video and voice it over and tell you what you are doing wrong, how to practice it, what to do so you can land it. We're basically a full service center to make sure that you learn how to skateboard and that we push skateboarding all over the world and get more skateboarders on the map of the world of skateboarding. Let's go Braille Army, get out there and progress. All right, guys, a huge thanks to Darren for coming out and filming some incredible slow motion shots with us today. He has an awesome channel. It's called Scapo. The link will be in the description below. And uh, what do you got on there? So Scapo was actually my first ever YouTube channel from back in 2006. I got my start in filmmaking through skateboarding and I am starting back up again. I'm trying to get back to my roots with skateboarding. It's it's just it's what inspires me. <laughs> it's, it's what makes me tick. So uh, yeah, you're gonna find all kinds of awesome, fun, slow motion skateboarding videos as well as just fun antics as I travel around with all kinds of awesome skateboarders from around the world. It's gonna be some fun. Check it out down below if you wanna check out more of that stuff.
Check out all the other videos, subscribe, like, leave a comment below, and you, yes you, go to BrailleSkateboarding.com and be part of the map of the whole world. Make sure after you make your account you log in so you're on the map. Let's go Braille Army.